Good morning, my friends. It is a beautiful day in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Hey. And today, me and Kristen are going to split up. She's gonna do Christmas shopping, kind of late, but still, it's, it's before Christmas. And I'm taking this girl to the Discovery Lab Museum place thing. Yeah, I got that right. I am out doing some Christmas shopping. We have a couple gifts we have to pick up. Actually, like most of the gifts we need to pick up still. But I'm starting at a place downtown called the Box Yard. This is a really interesting place because it's all made of like shipping containers and they have a little bit of everything. So we're gonna see what we can find here. So in case you guys haven't seen it, this is the place that has the big slide made completely of packing tape. And they got all these other packing tape slides. It's crazy that they actually hold our weight. These stores are really cool because they have a lot of local stuff. Like all of this is Oklahoma stuff and it's locally made, locally designed. Very, very neat. And I love that it's all in a shipping container. Like how cool this store has four shipping containers that they made into one big store. Some of the stores are really small, so it's just one shipping container. This one here is Stem Cell. I was just in there and I got some stuff, but it was so loud I couldn't vlog. It's all science-y, really, really cool stuff. I'll show you actually. So I got this for our new baby boy. It's like a newborn onesie that has a little tie sewn on and suspenders and it's so cute. And actually now that I'm thinking of it, I maybe can't show you the rest. I don't want to be spoiling any gifts for anyone, so yeah, I probably shouldn't show you. Choo choo! <laughs> ah, now we're doing the tape slide. Chell is all about it. Look at her, she's doing so good. Last time we were here, she didn't really climb on her own, but I think we may have left her in socks, which which would have been hard for her. But you're just a good climber now, aren't you? Yeah, she is. Oh, there's another slide down here. I actually never saw this one. Oh my gosh, I should have got that on camera. That was cool. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> now we're going up the big slide. All by yourself, you're going by yourself. I'm gonna let her do it. I think she's big enough. I think she's old enough. Whee! Plus, she's not going that fast. Whee! She's doing good. All right, here comes Dada. I'm gonna get you. Da. Dude, whatever this is looks cool. Oh, oh, I see what it is. There's a little pathway for balls, so you can put the ball in there and just make it go where you want. Watch this, Chell. Watch. <laughs> now entering the dinosaur exhibit. It's so crazy that they have these, by the way. Didn't they recently realize that like dinosaurs actually had feathers? Like they have more evidence of it. So are these technically outdated? I don't know. Eh, either way, still cool. You see the big dinosaur over there? He's saying hi. He goes, Brrr. You know, just by looking at these guys, it makes me think like how much could they really survive, you know? Like think about like just an average year for us anywhere. These dinosaurs, they could probably survive in the, the minuses, maybe. I don't know, like I don't know much about dinosaurs. So whatever wiped these guys out, man, that must have been really, really bad. This kind of makes me want to go back and do a little more research into dinosaurs. Maybe I will. Chell, let me see. Oh, you look so cool. Those are so cool. <laughs> Saying bye-bye the dinosaurs. Bye-bye dinosaurs. <laughs> I am finished with my shopping. I still have a couple more things we need to pick up, but for the most part, I think I got it all done in like an hour and a half, which is amazing. That box yard store, I, I love it. I mean, the series of stores there are so cool. They're all unique, they're all different. They have an ice cream parlor, they had a comic book store, an antique store, everything that you could ever want. Very, very cool though. So I'm headed to the Children's Museum. Hopefully they're still having fun in there. I bet they are. Chell Marie like loves this place and Corey and I kind of like it a lot too. So, you know, that helps. We're all back together and we have one more store to get to. This store is in downtown Tulsa and I legit have no clue how to get here, but apparently this guy does. Yeah, it looks like a really interesting store. And you saw it in the Big Mean Kitty song. There was like a robot in front of the store. I saw it while filming and I was like, that's a really cool store. I'm gonna yeah. come back. So that's where we're going. 
these streets downtown are all kind of like one way or two way and there's really no telling which is which so I'm glad Corey knows where we're going because I get confused. Here we are, Decopolis, Decoopolis. They have a huge dinosaur. That's pretty cool. Oh wow, that is pretty sweet. <laughs> How much do you think that is? Why does it say try me? There's a try me button. Try it, is it gonna talk? It's like it's either burping or oh, it's not still, that still going. We need to get this thing and put a toilet underneath it. <laughs> Back here they have like a tiki bar. Interesting. Coolest umbrella ever. Do it again. Wow. You want to try it? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> it's slightly terrifying, but she also wants to like get it. <laughs> this way. No, no more. <laughs> yeah, this way. Yeah. Turn it. Other way. Push. Push. Good job. Yep, close you up. <laughs> <laughs> Success. I think we are 99% finished with our holiday shopping. We haven't gotten our cards out yet, but that's okay. They can be New Year cards if they ever get sent out. But I think we're good. I think we got pretty much everyone on our list. I think we might have a couple more, but for the most part, yes, I think. Yeah. 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 Dude, so remember how I said the other day I got a new phone because my other phone was just like acting up. It was really, really bad. For what we do for a living, for what I do, how I use my phone and how much I use my phone and all of those things, this is perfect for me. But I found what is probably the greatest feature in this phone, which I didn't realize is a feature. How many times do I lose my phone, Kristen? A lot. All the time. All the time. I am a horrible person when it comes to losing things. This thing will find itself for you. I mean, all you have to do is walk into a room and say, Hey Siri, where are you? Right here. All right, guys. Well, it is getting kind of late, so I think I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye. Thanks for watching. Hope you had a great day today, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Oh, wait. Sad panda. Hmm.